here in Helsinki, Russia's Alexei Yagudin was number one in the world. Teammate of Geny Plashenko was number two, and American Michael Weiss was third. This year, the worlds have come to the French Riviera, and once again, Alexei Yagudin is number one, but only after the men's short program. Monday night, Yags was awesome, and now is only four and a half minutes away from becoming world champion three years in a row. And over his shoulder once again, his rival, his countryman, Evgeny Plashenko, who is also dazzled. The 17-year-old is in second place and could become the youngest world champion ever. In third, Michael Weiss needs a quad and the skate of his life. And right behind these three men, Mr. Never Count Me Out. The men's free skate tonight at the 2000 Worlds on CTV. on CTV and from the roller skaters on the boardwalk outside to the figure skaters arriving inside for tonight's men's free skate. Elvis Stoiko among the usual suspects and Alexei Yagudin. He does not want to give up his world title without a fight tonight. Hi everybody, I'm Rod Black and welcome back to our coverage of the world. Tonight it's the battle of the Russians. Alexei Yagudin, the two-time world champion, looking for a three-peat up against the 17-year-old wonder kid, Evgeny Plushenko, who could become the youngest world champion ever. Not to be forgotten, Michael Weiss of the United States and Canada's Elvis Stoiko, the three-time world champion who currently sits in fourth place after the short program. At 28 years old, there is speculation that this might be Elvis's last Worlds. If indeed that is the case, what a way to go out, making it back to the podium.